bags come in all shapes, sizes and price ranges. Most women wouldn't dream of leaving the house without one. Female Europeans own an average of seven bags. The Italians are the most avid handbag owners, with an average of 60 each. The fashionistas of Milan are experts when it comes to what constitutes the perfect bag. Mine are all big. Stylish. It has to be practical. Not too big, but not too small. A bag is like a woman's mobile home. Um, I have a Gucci, um, Dior, I got it in Canada, Chanel and a Prada. We carry them around everywhere. So I think that's why it's important to have a really good quality bag. I think I have a hundred. <laughs> French sociologist Jean-Claude Kaufmann has peeked into the bags of 75 women. He concluded that bags are about more than pure function. There's always talk of love when it comes to bags. The inner love for your bag as an everyday partner. And then there's the passionate love of the bag enthusiast who falls head over heels. Show me your bag and I'll show you mine. Kaufmann is familiar with every type of bag owner. Behind the bags is a certain philosophy of life. Some women are obsessed with the idea of traveling light. Others want to be prepared for every eventuality with an umbrella in case it rains, and something for every scenario, clothes or underwear to change into. What about carrying one trusty bag versus a different one for each day of the week? The one bag woman is most concerned with comfort, so she has her constant companion. The multi-bag woman cares about appearances, about making an impression. She likes to redefine her image every morning. Back in Milan, there's no getting away from the fact that handbags are a huge status symbol. But the bag itself can only tell us so much about its owner. The contents are the real giveaway. My purse, my pencil case, tissues, a little makeup bag, cell phone, bottle of water, deodorant, you never know. <laughs> Oh, it's such a mess in there. I'm not trying that. Many women wouldn't let a stranger anywhere near their handbag, but Kaufmann was granted a privileged peek for his book, Le Sac. There are lots of small, private things that are very personal. Handwritten notes, for example. We're not just shopping lists but lists of things to do, or traits people want to change, and photos, and lucky charms, or stuffed animals. Mess makes stress. A woman spends an average of 76 days of her life rummaging through her handbag. But despite this, the bond between a woman and her bag is unbreakable. A woman once said to me, loving a bag is much better than loving a man. Life with men can be stressful. But bags are different. A new love is exciting, but your old love doesn't die either. Agree or disagree, Jean-Claude Kaufmann has succeeded in at least uncovering a few handbag secrets.